Good day, fellow investors. Buffett is very old and therefore losing his touch. There were many comments, Buffett is sitting on cash because he's too old to understand the AI revolution. We are on an AI wave that will last at least 10 years. And he didn't understand crypto either. Also, why doesn't Buffett get criticized for having such a huge cash position? He has been very wrong. Further also, he says that crypto is red poison. Those who listened lost a lot of money. Now let's talk facts. Yes, he is old, 93 years old, can be considered also old in whatever environment. Oh, look at another fact next to his age, net worth. Now, if someone has more from crypto and AI, please let me know in the comments or send me an email. Now, he's now 93. When he was around 60, 70, Barron's Wall Street wrote, what's wrong, Warren? For more than 30 years of unrivaled investment success, Warren Buffett may be losing his magic touch. This was December 1999, because Warren Buffett, Berkshire Hathaway went down 40% in a year and a half from 1998 to 2000. At the same time, the index went up 18%. That's a huge difference. And everyone was saying that Buffett is losing his touch and he is too old to understand internet that changed the world and now he's too old to understand the AI revolution. And let's talk about his cash. You see here he has been piling that cash over the last five years and if we look at what happened to the S&P 500 it doubled over the last six seven years and exactly in line to when Buffett really started pile on that cash, despite buying Apple here, started being safer. And now that interest rates went from zero to 5%, now he is really pounding on that cash situation. Because let's compare things a little bit. This is the S&P 500 earnings from October 2018 to now, those earnings went up 21%, which means 3.8% growth per year. If I go further back, 2007, 3% growth in earnings over 15 years. This is adjusted for inflation, of course, but inflation was 1-2% back there. Now, if we look at Berkshire just now from the 200 billion in cash, 5%, they are making 10 billion in earnings just from the cash. And let's also compare the S&P 500 business perspective versus Berkshire. As I said, earnings went up 21%. Berkshire 2018, 24 billion in operating earnings, adjusting for all the stock price accounting shenanigans that have to be done, unfortunately, there. If we account 28 billion operating earnings, 37, so 50% up from the 24, sorry, not 28, 24 billion. That's 8.5% growth per year in earnings, which beats by far the S&P 500 growth in earnings. Of course, the S&P 500 did much better, but Buffett knows what is investing. He has been there, seen it, and we might not have seen it. And why is he so wary of this AI or whatever? Because he's here to compound. And let's say you compound over 20 years or 15 years, you start with 1,000, at 10% per year, if you just keep on compounding, you end up to 4,000. If there is one year, just one year, when you experience a 50% loss, and then you keep on compounding, you get to half of that. Just one year of loss destroys your compounding. This is a 2x. And that is what makes a huge difference over time. And that is why Warren Buffett 
doesn't chase the AI revolution, isn't happy with 1.3% dividend yield that, yes, has been growing at 4.8% per year over the last five years, but if it just keeps on growing at 4.8% per year, in 20 years, the dividend yield will go from 1.3% to 3.3%. That's nothing, still nothing, especially compared to the 5.5% yield that Buffett is getting on his cash now. But you say companies are doing buybacks Look at the buyback activity over the years. When stocks are cheap, buybacks crash. Buybacks crash. A little bit cheaper stocks, buybacks crash, and we haven't yet seen this, but just wait. Yes, dividends are growing, everything is okay, but this is my warning. You have to choose whether you want this compounding line or this one. Even if this one might go faster, it takes to come there. So invest at your own risk. We are here value investors. This is what we focus on. And Buffett is not old. Buffett is just doing value investing, something that he has been doing for 70 something years now, even more. It worked for him. It worked for me over the last 20 something years. It keeps on compounding while, I don't know, Polaroids from the 1960s, who is using them? Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.